What's the crack lads? Welcome back to the channel and today we're going to be talking about a brand new mode that looks to be coming to eFootball, eFootball Strike Arena. Now this mode was uncovered by Durandel over on Twitter. We're going to watch the video in a couple of minutes but I want to talk about it, right? So over on his Twitter, he has a load of stuff up on it. If you guys want to check that out, he's a load of screenshots and stuff. And we're going to just talk about it, right? And show you kind of what the game looks like or what the mode looks like. Now, as Dorndell has said here, right? This is the information on it. And we'll also talk a bit about the gameplay as well, right? We'll get into this in just a second, right? So the, about the tackling and the actual gameplay itself, okay? But this is obviously from a version of the, you know, game that hasn't released yet. You can see there until the official release comes. This is a, a, a version of eFootball 4.2. That does not have this mode yet this is a brand new strike arena mode that dorndell had up on twitter from the files right so again i'm just looking at the video that he posted um i haven't played this myself or anything but there's a couple of things that you can see in this game right it's very kind of arcadey it's a 3v3 kind of like futsal style game there are no tackles or shoulder charging there are rewards after each game there is no pause button in the match it seems to be very very fast and it seems to be very very frantic with like power-ups and we're going to talk about that right so also the official description here seems to be a description from eFootballer you can check it out as well on Twitter but we have the image here so it says it's a 3v3 match where you control one of the players on a special field surrounded by walls you can experience intense matches that will keep you on edge until the final whistle thanks to exclusive features like overdrive and chain each match lasts two minutes with up to 30 seconds of extra time. Extra time will continue until golden goal, basically, and gains possession of the ball. Overdrives are powerful actions. We'll show you them in a second. They're kind of like the old style FIFA Street game breakers and overdrive tackles as well, which seem to be linked to the players. So for example here, Leo Messi's overdrive is aero drive, which is a shot with top spin that dips sharply. And that's his command and that's his charge time. So it's very kind of FIFA Street-ish. It's very kind of arcadey. Um, this is kind of like the main screen that they have here. This is all subject subject to change. As I said, lads, this is on Dordell's Twitter with the video that he put up. This is not my gameplay. Um, I haven't played the game, obviously. But I feel like when looking at this now, it looks like that there's a lot of work on into this mode, right? You can see all the players have different uh, skills. Phantom Knuckle, Heavy Smash, Aero Drive. Now, obviously, comparisons are going to be drawn back to EAFC's Volta or Rush. You know whichever one of these it's very similar in what they're probably trying to do there will they integrate some sort of pro clubs feature or bring it into dream team where you can use your use your special cards obviously eafc have gone for this kind of more while it's still arcadey it is obviously not as arcadey as this you know you can see here with the big bright colors maybe this is the new uh, color scheme that they're going to go for but it's more about these kind of like I suppose arca arcade style power-ups you can still see the movement the movement actually looks quite slick the dribbling looks a little bit more fluid we may do a video on that if you guys want to see more of it but you can see these kind of anime style power-up shots this initially reminded me of something like rocket league or something like that where you have different power-ups and stuff obviously if you're a fan of eFootball or you're a fan of football games and you grew up playing pez this is a big departure from that but let me know your thoughts on it i mean obviously if this is just a mode that they're going to be bringing in or if it's going to be tied to an event there you can see the special charged sliding tackle as well so it seems to be that the gameplay is just going to be kind of pass shoot dribble um with no real like advanced uh, attacking or defending uh styles like with you know shoulder charging or sliding tackles or anything like that unless you're using a special ability and it's the same with these shots they're a special ability shot right there okay so that is going to be very very interesting and as i said this really reminds me of fifa street that's originally what it reminded me of fifa street with the game breakers if you guys remember these old fifa street videos with the game breakers where you could power up your meter by doing skills and tricks and then you'd have these special abilities that were unsavable that's what it looks like in here especially that you have a chain command as well and you can see the dip in shots that each player has that seem to be tied to animations or seem to be tied to different things with the game um and also i like the fact that you can miss certain tackles as well that is that is kind of nice that it's just not an auto um you know score or an auto shot right that you can still save it also with the chain count up in the top right hand corner that seems to be for successive passes so the more chain the higher the chain goes the more powerful your stuff becomes your passes your shots your tackles and it's charging your meter for the player's special ability 
So yeah, that's pretty much it, lads. I mean, it's it's a short and sweet video. Obviously, this mode isn't out. Obviously, this is just in the game files that was uploaded by Dorindel. Let me know what you guys think of it. It's called Strike Arena. Is this something that interests you or is it a bit thumbs down for you? Let me know and let me know when you think this will come as well. Peace.